New at five, more trouble for comedian Cat Williams. This latest viral video shows Williams allegedly punching a Hall County teenager. Williams' attorney spoke exclusively with Channel 2's Nicole Carr. She is live in Buckhead. Nicole. Well, Cat Williams is out on bond for several other assault related charges, but his attorney here in Buckhead doubts any charges will stem from this latest incident. He says his client was clearly targeted and provoked. And you see Cat Williams sit down and just say, like, leave me alone. Okay? And, and you hear this kid just trying to bring it on. It's what happens before and after this now viral YouTube video that matters, according to comedian Cat Williams' attorney. Unfortunately, it seems that somebody was really kind of working on him. Gainesville police are interviewing witnesses to this alleged assault where Cat Williams is seen punching a teenager in the Melrose Place housing projects earlier this week. Finling, who provided this video clip, says his client had spent more than half a day playing soccer, giving out money and encouraging children right in front of a police officer. But one teenager kept picking to the point of this viral punch and takedown. Finling says the antagonizing is obvious in a series of YouTube videos. When you have somebody that's clearly targeted and somebody's in their face and pushing them and pushing them, no one can put their self in that scenario. Finling, who says his biggest concern is Cat Williams giving of himself and being taken advantage of, says he doubts charges will be pressed when police review the whole scenario, even though Williams is currently out on bond for several other recent assault related charges. I don't think anybody would punish you for that. And in Gainesville, police confirmed no one ever came forward to report the incident. They found out about it on social media, just like everyone else. And that's why they're investigating at this point, interviewing witnesses. And they say they want to make sure the video wasn't cut and edited in a certain way. The video we all saw. At this point, no charges have been filed. We're live in Buckhead. Nicole Carr, Channel 2 Action News. Right.